far out in space, in the last crystal sphere before the eternal heaven of fixed stars, Saturn's slow orbit marked the limits of the solar system for the ancient world. It was Galileo who broke through the darkness, aided by his telescope, and discovered what would symbolize, more than any other planet, the beauty of the solar system. Saturn's cloak of rings, constantly changing its appearance as if in a dance around the planet, aroused the curiosity of observers on Earth. What is the nature of these rings? Are they etched on a solid, inflexible disk attached to the planet? Or are they perhaps a colorful cloud of fragments hovering around it like bees around a hive? Why are the rings separated from one another? And why is their width so small? Observations of Saturn have revealed that the planet is flattened at the poles to a greater extent than any other planet in the solar system. Does this flattening at the poles have to do with the great speed of Saturn's rotation? The findings of more advanced scientific research only widened the circle of questions regarding Saturn, as the observational data that reached scientists posed new challenges to their thinking. Closer observation of Saturn's atmosphere revealed cloud bands, bands that circumscribe the planet. It was discovered that these clouds move through Saturn's atmosphere driven by intense storm winds. Could they be related to the radiation emitted by Saturn? Radiation far more intense than it receives from the distant Sun? The closer we get to Saturn, the greater the possibility of revealing its inner secrets and perhaps learning about their relation to the secret of Saturn's magnificent beauty.